I think the Secretary of State has made a really brave decision to announce a pause in proceedings because, as you'll have seen from the critiques of the original Draft Wales Bill, there was a fair degree of unease that this didn't really meet the constitutional needs of Wales at this moment. Um, there was too much in the Bill, really, that we felt, all of us, um, politicians of all sides, academics, civic society, the presiding officer of the Welsh Government and so on, felt didn't really deliver the kind of coherent and robust settlement for Wales that we, we hoped it would. Um, significantly, far too many reservations because I think overall that bill represented uh, what's been called a reserved model grafted onto a, a, a conferred model infrastructure or with a conferred model mindset and I think that's really affected the um, uh, complexion of the bill. Too many reservations without principles and rationale behind them. Um, the idea of ministerial consent being a block on Welsh legislation, the necessity test which was real anachronism and could have acted as a massive break on Welsh government legislation. Um, all of that I think hopefully will come out. Um, we know that there is a, a working group established, a panel uh, with the Lord Chief Justice's office to look at the issue of where distinctive Welsh body of law and, and uh, jurisdiction is being made now and I think Wales' uh, distinctive law has to be reflected really in, in what comes out with the, the new bill. So I think where that leaves us is um, we've got a big opportunity really. I mean clearly we haven't got a great deal of time to construct a new uh, Wales bill but I think this time there's more buy-in between the Wales office and the Welsh Government which has incredible expertise and capacity. Um, and there's a, a, a developing consensus over what needs to feature in the next Wales Bill. I guess the other thing I would say is that there's some good features of the original Bill, which I hope will be carried forward into the new one, around electoral autonomy, around additional powers, around the, the financial and fiscal settlement for Wales. And all of those things are really important, so I hope they'll feature in the, in the next Bill as well.